don't think this show is good for me to watch, but here we are. <laughs> So we all go sit down at the same table, and Vanessa did not ask me not a damn question. <laughs> the lipstick on her neck. That is for you and her at another time. I mean, like. Huh? <laughs> I mean, you may as well tell them now. I'm not Vanessa, and like, Vanessa's not here to talk for herself. Like, go tell, go fucking throw a beer in her face. <laughs> They were like making me defend it. Like, but why did you do it? And I'm like, I don't know. And they weren't like taking that as an answer. And what more of an answer can I give? Jesus Christ, Vanessa. It's gonna be okay. <laughs> they look so snuggly. <laughs> I'm asking for you to like open up and communicate with me. And we I are. think that- We are. <laughs> and now we're all more serious and- Oh my God. We actually both signed up for this, so. And we did sign up for um, it. I'm not saying that I didn't. I'm just saying I'm surprised. You're surprised. Ozzy just like wants to leave in any indication of conflict. But what makes you think that our conversation can be a high? Why do you think I... that our conversation is negative? I can have emotions. Mm, you can. Just because... <laughs> Ozzy's checked out. Like, there's really no point talking right now. Like, I'm... Bye. I want to go back out, actually. Can I just go back <laughs> out? Sure. Is this what you do to Sam? Yeah. Mm. Wow. When is she it? wants to talk and she's yeah. hurt? Is this what you do to her? Yeah. You wanna ask is her? this what you do to Sam? You, you talk to her? Oh, God. I'm not willing to talk to you when you're in this mood. Well, Thanks. this is the only mode I have, so... <laughs> oh, God. Oh, as he's dipping. Bye. They said, nope. I don't want marriage. I don't want conflict. I don't want any of it. Bye. I don't want to be married to someone who couldn't communicate with me effectively, couldn't give me what I needed in order for us to talk. I'm sorry, like, I get being bad at conflict. Like, I, I get it, right? But also, you know, you've known Mildred, what is it, three weeks now, four weeks? And you haven't communicated with her how to best communicate with you. You've just been avoidant the whole time. How do you expect her to know how to best communicate with you when it's a different sort of way that you need. Why wouldn't you communicate that? I feel bad for Sam. She just like left it there. Like she could have placed it back there so that I'm, <laughs> it's not in my way. Ozzy doesn't give a fuck, Mildred. <laughs> you know what I do? I just really, really, really fucking wish that she would fucking take out the trash. I don't want to be here alone. Oh, God damn. <laughs> I want to hear Blair's thoughts on Vanessa. I will say, not saying I fully dislike her, but like- Come on, just say that you fully dislike her. Oh. We didn't know this would be like the best days of our lives right. every day. God, that's so cute. I love her. I mean, <laughs> yay. Y'all said that? Okay. <laughs> Why? Cause it's been like three weeks. <laughs> Ray did have like an intimate moment with someone else here. What about your um, ex? She's, she's with a nice person. Okay. She just so. happens to also be with the person that Ray's living with's ex-girlfriend. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> I'm happy you're meeting Mal, because, like, in any regard, she's going to be a part of my life forever. <laughs> the dad's expressions. <laughs> Big Papa has arrived. Oh, she and just, she makes me on edge, man. Oh. Marriage should be like a lease, like a seven year lease. At, yes. the, at the end of the seven years, you decide whether you want to renew it or not. So. <laughs> and this know. is where I get my idea of marriage. But no, like, no. I just don't, <laughs> you know. I don't get it, man. You get married. If it doesn't work out, you get a fucking divorce. It's not like you're stuck in the marriage forever. Like. Christ, it's not even a life sentence, man. I know that I've I've known for a while that I I've loved you. <laughs> these two move so quickly. It's terrifying to me. Will these two end up together? I'm her wife right now. <laughs> I think we met in like 07. Do you want to know how old I was in 07? <laughs> no, I, I actually I, don't. No, I do want to know. I need oh, to know. God. In 07, I was 11 years old. <laughs> You red flag. Waving in the wind. <laughs> I don't know what's going on, so. <laughs> None of 
friends, they must know. In order for us to gain more clarity, if there's anyone else out there, or if it's actually our problems that we need to work on. I feel like that makes no sense. <laughs> so how do you know if the intimacy is there or not? Good question. Hold hands right now. <laughs> I love this chick. Try to kiss each other, try to touch each other. <laughs> and if you don't like it, then be like, fuck it, I tried, right? Can we get her as the host? Well, what is that, your leg? <laughs> <laughs> I felt something stiff. Hey, that's good progress, though. Mm -hmm. Percy, I went from, I don't even want to touch your hand to, <laughs> will you big spoon me? I kind of like them now. <laughs> Whatever she's coming at this with, like, it's going to be life-changing. That's a big thing. What do you want? I've got to look hot. What do you want, Vanessa? I don't I don't know if I want to watch like next few episodes watching Vanessa try and manipulate Xander. I just oh I don't know if I'm ready for that. Is she like leaning so far away? She's leaving us. Don't tell cry? her that. <laughs> Use yours. Go ahead, tell her. <laughs> I know. I'm worried about your ex putting her claws in you. Mm-hmm. Me too. Thank you for loving me the way you do. I'm so nervous for these two. Like, I kind of, like, am really rooting for these two. The whole concept, it just, it still fucks with my head. Like, it's a lot of feelings in a very short amount of time. That's, that freaks me out. But anyway. <laughs> oh, Ozzy's back. Ozzy and Mildred, how was your first trial marriage? I mean, you may as well go, Ozzy. You didn't finish. I don't think there's any more we can say about the situation or the version. Oh, I have a lot to say, Aussie. Okay. okay. So you can uh, just you speak have for yourself at this point. <laughs> oh, that I shut you out? That's not yeah. true. I was open the whole time. Sure, Jan. I had to put myself first. I... I mean, obviously this is edited a certain way, but did Aussie think of anyone but themselves? I, I don't know. Do you like people just offer me so much unconditional love? Oh my god. Is that what I need? Like one crazy night every three or four years to feel like, okay, that was exciting and now I can get back into my relationship. Oof. And you and I had agreed not to do anything physical when we what? came in here. What? You looked like the like the first day we're like, don't get mad if I leave with someone else. Um, I have a little thing that I wrote. Is this an appropriate time to read it? Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my God, what is it? I value you all. Thank you for listening. <laughs> Your apology is performative. Xander has shown in the three weeks that we've been together that she can absolutely be that future. Man, you can't, you cannot like throw shade at Mal being like, oh yeah, it's all fun and games for three weeks, but can you hold on to it for years? And then not reflect that on yourself. You guys did talk about romantically being involved. Were you physically involved as well? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We did speak to what we'd physically. Yeah, and that was your choice. <laughs> but, but it's hard, obviously, to hear this. <laughs> oh, pop by me. I don't pop by me. I want a marriage with you now. Oh my God. You want a marriage if you get to fuck around every three or four years because you'll get bored otherwise. <laughs> My heart's broken. Because <laughs> Vanessa didn't think Xander would get a connection with anyone. Xander's like, oh fuck, there's so many better options out there. I definitely want this experience with you. Oh, I hate that like smirk. Ugh. Oh, it's so like transparent. I'm really anxious for Xander. I don't want Vanessa to like manipulate them. Ugh. I don't trust you. Ooh. Like, it's fine, I sleep better on the fucking couch anyways. Oh my God. What I was trying to do was grow to the point of wanting to marry you. Shut the fuck up, Vanessa. Oh my God. We did have sex. Like with mouths. <laughs> I do want specifics. <laughs> God. And more than once. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna sit in your lap, okay? Mm-mm. Mm -mm. Oh God! I uh, fell in love with Xander. That's gonna like make Mao's situation worse, cause Mao's whole thing was like Yoli falls in love so quickly and easily with lots of people. And then I have you. <laughs> oh fuck! Fuck! You are in love with Xander. 
These two are not making it out. No way. You're it for me and I'm telling you that. Whoa, okay. As I started falling for Xander, it didn't make me love you any less. OT3. <laughs> I'm not like I'm, that. I know. I'm just... I'm just I'm verbally fine. saying that yes. because I know how to say things now. <laughs> I don't, uh, yeah, I feel like these these two could go either way. I just, I can't read Aussie. I can't. These two aren't good for each other. No, I feel like they'll end up leaving together. You don't have to validate any of my feelings and that's fine. You don't normally. I don't, what does Oof. that mean? I've never been put first in this relationship. Oof. Yeah, these two aren't ending up together. <laughs> it was supposed to end with me and you. Ooh. I feel like Ray needs to like just be on her own and work on herself. I just feel like I'm not being given a fair chance. I mean, you had four years. <laughs> I don't know what you want from our relationship right now. Can you tell me? I don't think they know. I love you. <sighs> say it back. Shut the fuck up, Vanessa. Fucking <laughs> say it back, Xander. They'll say it if they feel it. The way you, the way you see it, it's- Hold on, I just feel like there was a blockage there. Can I say what I was going to say? Okay, go. I figured it happens like once a week and there's 52 weeks in a year. Oh my God. Yeah. Once a week? Like, really? Like <laughs> they didn't realize after the first breakup or the second breakup or the third breakup. They're on 50 and they still haven't figured out that they're not good for each other. <laughs> right now, do you feel like you're on the track to get engaged yet? I feel like I am. Oh, really? Really? I think that's where Mildred was frustrated. That doesn't. I, we don't have. We don't. Oh, here we go. I'm trying to breathe through this right now. That's Can we just stop? Stop for a minute. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's insane. One conversation that they don't feel comfortable comfortable with. It's just a complete shutdown of everything. It exactly. ticked me off just now. Oh God. Yeah. I need a moment. That would be so tough. You would be walking on eggshells, just making sure you don't bring up a topic that shuts Ozzy down. It's not even like Ozzy's like, oh, look, I'm not really feeling like comfortable talking about this. Can we not? Sure. Okay. And then they continue on with other conversations. As soon as a topic is brought up that they don't like, they walk away. Like, it's not even like they... They can't move past it. It's crazy. Like, you don't need to be here. You could have left at any point in time. It's true. She doesn't regret. You don't regret what you did. And that's fine. And I'm not asking you to. But I don't have to be. You guys were on a break. <laughs> we were on a break. I don't know, Lexi. I mean, I feel like you keep saying the issue is with Vanessa. And if it was someone else, like Yoli, you wouldn't have an issue. But. I don't know. I feel like the issue is she slept with someone, regardless of who it was, right? And in that case, why the fuck would you come on this show? Oh my god. I just realized I love you even more than I thought Shut I did before. Shut the fuck like, up. This is insane. That's not love. That's desperation and fear of being alone. How do they steer those things? Because they got to steer it back to like the landing point. They don't just like land it wherever. <laughs> Through this whole process, my mind has been focused on you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Another fucking note. Here we go. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I am so sorry that it took me this long to give you my all. But I had to. <laughs> I had to find out exactly what I could offer before I could offer it to you. And, and what is that? And what is that? I'm ready to let go of fear and fully commit to growing this beautiful life of ours. Oh, my God. Don't fall for it, Xander. Weeks ago, you wanted to marry me. And there's something to that. Oh, God. Ah! I knew I didn't want to fucking see this. Oh, you could just, you could just see, like, if there was someone in this experiment that was, like, really into Vanessa and was really hitting it off with Vanessa, then, like, she would be cheating the fuck on Xander, like, through this three-week trial. You could just see it. Oh, it's sucks to watch. So why don't you just grab a handful of blueberries? No, they that's me. They get a little bruisey in my fingertips. I don't want it. Yeah, that's me. I feel excited about us right now. What about Ray? Has Ray's view on marrying Lexi changed at all? But I think the finality of marriage always scares me. So it hasn't changed. The Brady to my Gronky. That means nothing to me. <laughs> I don't, I'm, I'm assuming basketball players, right? 
my favorite thing is when you just like talk yourself up like, I'm this shit. I think I need to do it now because if I don't, I think I'll cry. So mm. I'm gonna keep talking myself up. Good. Yeah. I feel bad now. <laughs> it just makes me think like with that kind of personality, how this show would be affecting them with the audience reaction. That's gotta be like really fucking tough to sit with. And then we don't know where it's gonna end up. Do you trust me and figure it out? I just, they're just not good for each other though. How often do you feel like I don't let you talk? All the time. <laughs> when do I have permission to speak? Oh, it's not that you should have permission to come speak. Come on. It, okay, so how do I not feel like I'm interrupting you all the time? But you do that by not interrupting. <laughs> Cool. I'm not gonna argue with you no more because I might never interrupt you again in your life. So don't worry about it. Fucking hell. That is toxic. Holy shit, it's been three weeks or, or two weeks already? My God. Like this is the first time thinking about getting married to a woman and I'm just like, that's gonna, that's, that is gonna be. How long have these two been together? I forgot. I wish they put more detail in like the title cards. Like pronouns, I would have loved. And like, the duration, like the time, how long their relationship they've been in. That would have been good to know. <laughs> I'm hoping with my heart that it's not too late to recreate everything that could have been. These two are gonna leave together, aren't they? Who is it, the bar first? Oh God. <laughs> um, oh. <laughs> <sighs> Vanessa, we are not friends. <laughs> Can you join us? Oh. Oh God. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> Fucking hell. Okay. I'm gonna go take a shot. <laughs> Zana. How do you feel about the decision? <laughs> Bye. <laughs> you know, no one likes you. That's what's happening, I just Vanessa. I don't understand. How do you not understand? What have you done to build any sort of friendship or relationship? with any of them. I do have to go over there. Are you avoiding me, Ray? Bye! Bye! <laughs> Are you avoiding me? Sorry, I, sorry, I didn't hear that. Bye, I gotta go there. <laughs> I don't miss you. Oh, God. I love you. <laughs> miss There's my... one right there, guys. <laughs> I feel what you guys are feeling right now. <laughs> Everyone is fucking feeling it. <laughs> you want me to Yeah. That's all I mean. <laughs> as soon as like she walked up and like we like like touched for a second i don't want that like but she's not gonna be in your life after this experiment because she's avoiding her <laughs> this was such a simple way for you to choose me oh god uh, i kind of feel ray in this one it's like i don't know i mean maybe it's an issue with my personality but i will 100 percent avoid someone over like having that confrontation with someone <laughs> She still clearly has power in this relationship. It sucks. Oh my but... God, Lexi. I just wanted you to not look at her and to just not talk to her. <laughs> Lexi, come on. Honestly, this is a you problem, Lexi. Like, it was literally like she got dragged into a group conversation. Everyone left. So she was left with Vanessa and then she dipped. But she's angry that she even made eye contact with her. <laughs> Fucking hell, Lexi but there's also comfort and ease and love with you and I. You can't have us both. <laughs> Why? <laughs> if I'm not that, then let me go. What if I don't wanna let you go? That's selfish. What do you want from me? I am dying for you, fam. What do you want? <gasps> That's how I feel about doing housework as well. I'm dying. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I just... <laughs> No, man. She's like, I'm dying for you, but like, you've been doing housework for three weeks. <laughs> oh, this is why I can't do relationships. I'm just, I don't take anything fucking seriously. God, what a fucking for? thing to say when you came in here wanting to marry someone else. Like, also so fucking disrespectful to me. <laughs> That's what you fucking signed up for. What are you talking about? Fucking hell. I hate this show. <laughs> When okay. that's happening, you don't listen to me. You're so in your head, you don't actually know what's happening. Mm. You have bad energy. Like, uh, you have bad energy. Yeah, but the thing is, I don't. <laughs> Here, but the thing is, you're wrong. 
Can you just entertain the idea that the reason why you don't like how I act now is because I'm not just giving in to all of your needs no, every that's single not time? Yeah. No, that's bullshit. I think about you all the time. I put you first. But you're calling her actual feelings bullshit? Yeah. I shut down. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, like, just is gone. Like, I know I said last episode, like, I'm someone like Ray that will avoid conflict, but like, that it's such an extreme with Ozzy. I'm not gonna keep enabling you anymore. Mm -hmm. I'm going to actually speak up now. Yeah. And that is what Ozzy doesn't like. Yeah, yeah. See, like avoiding conflict is one thing, but completely shutting down and walking away is another thing. I don't mean to make you feel like I was being rude to you. I'm sorry. It's not about what you mean to do. It's what you do. You need to ex acknowledge what you do and reflect on that. I'm accepting your truth. Why can't you accept my truth? <laughs> Are you? <laughs> I fucking did this shit. I fucking did this shit. I fucking did this shit. Jesus Christ. I hope this show is providing these people, like, therapy. Like, I'd rather... Our version of like a game, if you will, is like you coming home from work and me wearing something sexy, cooking dinner. Like that'll be my game. Okay. <laughs> Ray's like, yeah, I'm Dan. I mean, I want to get there. I love you. Okay, I just don't feel safe with you just yet. Oh my God. You're speaking to me in a very condescending okay. tone. So why did you ask me that question then? Why are you asking me that question? Your whole tone just changed. It's a conversation. You're not in listening mode because right now. Because you're telling me no. that I did something wrong. Oh. Fucking hell. Sam, get out. Like, fuck. But let's yeah. not just, like, blankly use that I'm good statement. Like, I don't. I, I'm good. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, you say that. You're starting to act like an ass right now. Mm -hmm. And you started talking to me in a very rude manner and you mm -hmm. called me mate. Mm -hmm. Why are you calling me mate all of a sudden? I don't know. You, you just, you can't have a healthy relationship. There's just no way. I really do hope Ozzy gets some help and is able to work through these, like, childhood issues that they're dealing with. Because the past hurts. You're gonna lose that person. Oh, God, Ozzy. There is actually, like, nothing that you can do for, like, Sam, though, until you start working on yourself it's undeniable that a part of that is you don't want to lose him yes and you'd be willing to yeah yeah but no, i can tell you that's no, not the dominant no but it has to be there yes her dad making some sense my heart's never broken like this i have no doubt that vanessa's heart is broken but i just don't think she understands why it's broken like the dad said i think like she's misunderstanding this heartbreak as like oh you know i'm heartbreaking broken of Xander's feelings for someone else instead of I'm heartbroken that my safety net is dissipating. What is what is the oh shit part? The oh shit was um, me falling in love with Xander. <laughs> and feeling a what? connection there. Mm -hmm. This chick was defending you so hard to Lexi. <laughs> I didn't realize I was so terrible in three years. I'm oh, not saying you're terrible. Oh, come on. Yoli, I'm tripping. I'm really tripping right now. Okay. Goodbye. Oh! This situation is just fucked up. <laughs> yeah! I'm just like, dude, why the fuck would someone want to get married to someone that isn't in love with them to begin with? God, I'm so curious who's gonna end up together. With everything I've been through, I don't think I would, I would just be in pain and I would just not even know how to... Oh, Ozzy. You know. I feel so, like, bad for Ozzy. Like, I really do hope that, like, they start getting into a good place. I do feel like it's always been you. I've always known. Well, this is getting hot. They're not gonna end up together. Ray won't do it. I see all of your change. I also always knew you did love me. I wouldn't have stayed around if I did it. I'm not over this yet. <sighs> I don't know what that noise was. Man, they're gonna leave us on a bloody cliffhanger. Now, time is up on the ultimatum. <laughs> Oh, but I'm keen. I'm keen. And if it's not now, I promise to come looking for you in the next lifetime, but not without asking you. Oh, God. Will you marry me? Let's see, we're not going to get the answer. <laughs> it's so fucking messy. Why the fuck am 
time I'm watching this show. I can't wait for next week. <laughs> oh, God. So that was episodes five through eight. Um, oh, God. <laughs> I have a lot of feelings and a lot of confusion and anxiety and fear. <laughs> I don't think this show is good for me to watch, but here we are. <laughs> it's been fun to watch, even though it's like anxiety inducing. It's still, you know, fun. And I'm still interested to watch the last two episodes. So um, check back here next week for those two. Uh, otherwise, if you want to watch my first four uh, episode reactions, check out this video here. Otherwise, I'll see you all in my next one. Okay, bye.